What's up everybody, MacBoy here, and uh, right now I want to make a video that is going to talk about uh, your clipboard. Uh, well, now on PCs and Macs, uh, when you copy something, uh, it holds it on your clipboard uh, until you paste it. It keeps holding it until you copy something else. So for example, I'm going to open up text edit here, and I'm going to type whatever. All right, as you can see, there's a bunch of uh, letters and numbers. I'm just going to highlight that all, and I'm going to hit Command C on my keyboard. That copies it to my clipboard. Now, if I go down a little bit, and if I paste it, there it is again. Paste it, there it is again. Paste it, paste it, paste it. And it's always going to be there. But if I type something else and copy that, what I copied before up here is now gone. And sometimes, if you do a lot of copy and pasting, like different URLs of uh, web pages that you really need, or different codes, or um, different items, or different maybe even serial keys that you need, and that you forget or that you copy over them, and now you don't have and you don't know where to get them back from, this application helps you a lot. Uh, there are two applications that do this um, that I mainly use. Uh, they they are called iClip and Jump Cut, uh, and I believe iClip comes with a price, but Jump Cut, I think, is freeware. Uh, let's start with iClip right now. So I'm just gonna search for iClip, and this is the icon that uh, iClip iClip comes with, and this is iClip that just popped up from my menu bar right here. What it is is basically a recorder of everything that you copied on your clipboard. It can hold up to 100, the last 100 things that you copied on your clipboard. So as you can see here, I don't know if you can see it clearly, but um, the first two or the last two are the letters that are typed, and the second one is those uh, different keys or items that are typed from the keyboard. And to get them back, you can simply, I don't know, open up a text edit or any f uh, text field, even on the, in, even in your browser and just hit the arrow key and it's gonna paste it there for you uh, here I have a M code right that I want again from a video click down and the M code will come up right there and it just keeps going down uh, to the last hundred things that you copied URLs and everything that you copied every single text that you have copied from your clipboard that's iClip now jump cut is just a small item in your menu bar and it runs completely in the background uh, nothing no icon in your dock and you just click on it and it just shows you a list of the recent things that you copied sorry for that the recent things that you copied like here uh, I believe it's showing me 50 and say I wanna say where's my here say I wanna paste uh, a URL right here from tiny URL and paste that and it comes in like that um, I believe that Jump Cut is much easier and it's much faster than iClip uh, because you don't have to enter your hotkey on your keyboard to show the window or show that little tab up uh, at the top for iClip and then you don't have to find the one you want and then go to the little arrow and then press uh, click on it so it comes up in your text edit. So Jump Cut, just find it and click on it and it's going to come up in any text field on your computer. Uh, that's basically it. This helps me out a lot when um, I'm copying URLs and M codes and serials for different programs. And I believe that this is going to help you out a lot too. Um, if this did help you out, please make sure you comment, rate, and subscribe to this video and channel. And the links to download these are in the description. And please, 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 if you liked it, let me know by commenting below. Okay guys, uh, this was MacBoy for MacBoy Productions. Make sure you follow me on Twitter, add me on iChat, and become a fan of MacBoy Productions on Facebook. Links are all in the description, guys. Thank you once again. Please make sure you comment, rate, and subscribe. Peace.